Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the ice dispenser solenoid in your refrigerator, unplug the power cord. Open both refrigerator doors. Depress the release button and pull out the ice bin. Insert a small flathead screwdriver into the side cover access hole and press down to release the locking lever, then pull the side cover forward to remove. Use the screwdriver to depress the retaining tab to release the ice maker assembly. Pull the assembly forward. Disconnect the wire harness and remove the entire assembly. Using a Phillips head screwdriver, unthread the two screws securing the ice dispenser solenoid. Use a flathead screwdriver to depress the retaining tabs to release the solenoid housing. Detach the sensor from the solenoid. Disconnect the wire connector and use a quarter inch socket or nut driver to remove the screw securing the grounding wire. Pull the retaining tab back and remove the old solenoid from the housing. You're now ready to install the new ice dispenser solenoid. Position the new solenoid in the housing, making sure the actuator tabs are aligned in the housing slots. Secure the grounding wire to the new solenoid with the screw. Connect the wire connector and snap the sensor into place. Snap the solenoid housing into position on the ice maker assembly and replace the screws to secure. Reinstall the ice maker by sliding the assembly part way into the housing. Reconnect the wire harness and push the assembly all the way back. Be aware the ice maker fill spout may make this difficult. Realign the side cover and slide it into place. Realign the ice bin on the track and snap it into position. With the repair completed, plug the power cord back in and your ice maker should be ready for use.